Olga Sokolova. I'm Russian and um, I dedicate myself to dance. I stand for art, for true language. It's to bring dance to a different level. It's to learn how to connect better your spirit to your movement. So you deliver the message, the message you want to express for your body. I want to teach dance um, to kids, but teach it not only for technique, but also for spiritual education. Dance is more than just a movement. It is a language. It is a hidden language of your soul. I've been dancing for um, my entire life. Um, I have started my career as a gymnast. Um, I was in uh, professional rhythmic gymnastics for almost 15 years and then I got a scholarship in Europe for um, contemporary dance, modern dance and uh, classical technique. Um, and I developed my own style where I fuse powerful gymnastics background with a very uh, technical classical dance. Um, it takes a lot of um, it takes a lot of concentration and focus because you really need to know what is your movement about and where it comes from. So I get inspired a lot by music as a dancer, but as an artist I get inspired by stories, by nature. I can get inspired by anything and I can incorporate it in my dance. and. Uh, create a story. I always try to create something that um, makes a difference and make them look different from anyone else. Recently I just did a music video with um, Chris Brown and Usher Monroe and they wanted for something, they, they asked for something futuristic, something classy, something technical and beautiful. Um, so I got to think about it and um, we came up with some great ideas. Um, I think the video is going to be amazing. I was very inspired by watching Chris dancing live on set. Genius dancer, genius artist, a very beautiful soul. And I don't think anyone in the world has his movement. <laughs> Right now, I'm working on an amazing project um, called Bali Doll. It's a musical, a musical that has live singers, beautiful dancers. It's inspired by classical Indian culture. We have a fusion of several styles, classical Indian dance, ballet, modern, hip hop, um, beautiful art forms. We have an amazing projections that what makes this show really different and um, hopefully by the end of this year we're gonna have it on Broadway and we're gonna take it um, to the world tour. I really believe in this show because it has a powerful message, very pow powerful message that that is needed in this world right now, our days. This show is um, this show is built for kids, but it's definitely very spectacular to watch for adults too. This show was created, um, was written, the story was written by Amrita Sen, and the, all the original music is composed by Anthony Marinelli, very known composer. And to work with these people is a blessing. One of the greatest artists I've ever collaborated with. <laughs> Selling author, Brandy Award, <laughs> Just a few weeks ago, um, I was lucky to see Latoya Jackson perform live and witness her beauty and the power of her spirit, her beautiful, absolutely beautiful energy. Um, 
I just love everything about Jackson's family. I think it's one of the greatest artistic dynasty ever existed. And um, just to watch Latoya perform, I think this new song, um, It Feels Like Love, is amazing. And I'm very excited for it to make it to album. This girl is light skin, I see her walk by. She gave a quick wink, and then I said hi, but then she moved on. I'm here um, in Boston. I'm here to collaborate with Geppetto, and um, I want to introduce him to a um, European vision of dance, and um, I want to add my dance style to his music, to his art. It's a very beautiful state. And um, I love Massachusetts. People are beautiful. I never really got to express my pain for what happened here in Boston. Um, respect and prayers to everyone who survived Boston bombing. And uh, my prayers go to victims. <laughs>